Hello everyone and welcome back to Animal Jam and we are here with Explorer Snow Lily as she is on her very first adventure, Return of the Phantoms. And ironically, she's actually here not to chase phantoms away, but because her phantom Whisper Jinx has gone missing and she's hoping if she follows rumor of where the phantoms have gone, that she'll be able to figure out where Whisper Jinx has gone. So she's really worried about him and I'm actually looking for one last plant. I think it's probably going to be nowhere near here. Ah, oh, it's going to be nowhere near here. But we are are looking for the one last plant that we need to help the bunnies at the bunny burrow with and once we manage to help them out look at their little sign they've even got a cute little sign and once we manage to help them out by watering all of the plants where's the last plant that's suffering i'm trying to bring it some fresh water but i can't find it use the well water to revive the last plant well where is it do you guys oh look the well is clean over here too oh wow so now that the well water is clean, we can water our crops. Wonderful for you guys. I'm so happy. I'm just looking for the last unhealthy plant that should be somewhere around here. <gasps> I can reach the treasure, you guys. Yay, 50 gems. Oh, 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 look, we can come over here. Cookie, you did it. Now we can use the well water to water our plants. Wonderful, Cookie. Aha, and there is the last plant. Fantastic. Go to the bunny burrow, find the key, and open the phantom door. Oh, cool. Look. <laughs> Explore Snow Lily can come all the way just straight through the water. That's so cool. All right. You doing good, pumpkin? Do you need anything? I was thinking Explorer Snow Lily, it would be the kind of explorer who's young and inexperienced, and the townspeople could sense that, and they would ask her to do all of this extra work to help them out. But it seems like everything's okay, and she's asking about anything going bump at the night in their closets so that she can hopefully find... Oh, cool. So she can hopefully find where Whisper Jinx went. All right. I don't see any bumpy... Oh, look at that plant. That's so cool. Oh, and there's even cute little, like, teacups put down. That's adorable. Little bunny burrow. Aw, that's so cute. Hello, George. Are you the one who bravely saved our crops? You're my hero. Thank you, George. This is a really nice burrow, by the way. I really love how you've, like, embedded the family wealth. Oh, wow, they're sitting on a lot of money. They're pretty wealthy. <gasps> Look at all the plants. Oh, and there's even a little art bench. Oh, it looks like they're a very well-to-do bunny family. Wow. Clover, how do you do? I found this key well, uh, a while back. I think it unlocks the phantom door to the far right of the bunny burrow. Well, you definitely wouldn't want anybody getting their hands on that. I mean, just having a random key laying around that could unlock an entire door to the phantoms. That's just asking to have a disaster of an adventure on your hands. All right. Well, we're off to look for Whisper Jinx. Poor Whisper Jinx. Lost. Lost out in the wilds. He's a good little phantom. All he wants is happiness and candy. There we go. Kick the door straight in. Yeah. Find four keys and rescue the trapped bunnies. Oh, we've got trapped bunnies going on now. Okay. What is this? Is this like a little save point or something like that? I'm not sure. All right. Let's keep going. Oh, 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 oh. I'm hiding in the tall grass so the phantoms can't see me. That's a smart move, little guy. Now, apparently there's four keys and some lost bun buns. That's a wolf only entrance. Whoops, a daisy. All right. There we go. So lost the grass there helped me get away. I could lead the phantoms to these these nice big plants. Hey, hey you, come over here, my friend. Oh, and apparently if I get close enough, I can... Oh, look at that, there's the key. Okay, so here's the key, and there's four trapped bunnies somewhere. So let's see if we can find out where they're hiding. And explore Snow Lily. It's adorable because I think she would just be like, my friend, my friend, my little Whisper Jinx, he's somewhere, he's lost somewhere around here. Whoops. All right, go away, Phantom. These guys are Whisper Jinx's big brothers and they're not the nicest. All right, let's see. Lots and lots and lots of Phantoms. Lots of plants to eat the Phantoms. But then where are the bunnies? Uh-oh. There's so many keys. But where are the bunnies I'm supposed to be helping out? Oh, oh no! They've kidnapped the bun buns! How could they? All right, out of here, Snowball. Help me unlock my cage. Hang on, hang on. I'll come back. I'll come back as soon as I can, little guy. All right, come here, you guys. Now that I know what you're up to, why do you even need little bunnies? What is that even about? All right, come here, you. Explore Snow Lily is no coward. She's willing to take you on. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, come on. Don't give up halfway through. Come on. Look, I even stole the key. You know what I'm up to now, so you need to follow me, okay? 
And then right up, I love Venus flytraps. <laughs> They're so amazing. I never knew that they were phantom destroyers. Snowball, you need to get out of here. Snowball, Jack, seriously, now's not the time to be like prancing and dancing. Oh, uh, maybe they're waiting for their siblings and they don't want to leave until like everybody is ready to go. Oh dear. All right. Well, let me go get the other keys. They really are silly bun buns. All right. I think I saw like tons of keys up here. Yeah, there's a key right there. Hey, you two. Come on down. You got some hungry, some hungry mouths waiting for you. There we go. And this is good because then we're clearing the path for them to be able to get back home without getting eaten. I wonder what that thing is. Maybe it is like a little save point. And I just haven't figured out how to use it yet. All right. And then, hey, yeah, we'll get rid of this guy too. Really, you know what Explorer Snow Lily should do? She should probably start keeping a garden. That's what we can do over at Sky Kingdom is we can start keeping a garden of her very own of these Venus flytraps because they're so good at helping out with keeping everybody safe from bad phantoms. But we'll also have to make sure we get a secure little home for Whisper Jinx because he's a good phantom and we don't want Whisper Jinx who just wants candy and happiness <laughs> to end up getting accidentally, accidentally eaten. That would be so sad. All right, there's the last key. We're good to go. I think we're almost leveled up too. Explorer Snow Lily, I'm so proud of you. And plus we also managed to find um, a little bit of treasure. Just a little bit. All right, there we go. All right, there you go, guys. And we leveled up, sweet. Hey, if you could just teleport over here, why didn't you do all of that? Great job, you defeated the phantoms and saved all of the bunnies. Please accept this gift and return through the adventure portal. Oh, <gasps> do I only get to pick one? Select a treasure chest. Um. Uh, this one. I got a bunny wheelbarrow. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh, that cracks me up. Whisper Jinx, you're back to me, little bunny. <laughs> that cracks me up that we got a bunny wheelbarrow because it's so like we managed to to get the 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 crops that we helped to water and everything. Oh, the bunnies just gave us a wheelbarrow of carrots. That's so cute. All right. And oh, there's a jack-o'-lantern nesting thing. Oh, that's so neat. There, it just keeps like ugh, new stuff is showing up all the time. It's so awesome. All right. And do we have anything that Explorer Snow Lily has actually, let's see, let's come over here. And anything Explorer Snow Lily has looked over recently that we could probably trade away. Um, it would be, it would probably have to be over at our den. So let's pop over here and we're going to go to explore Snow Lily's house. So we have Whisper Jinx back and we leveled up on our very first adventure. So I'm pretty pleased as punch about that. And you can see I've been decorating with some of the uh, candy related things that I have managed to get at that little adventure with our wonderful little Whisper Jinx. He actually has better luck getting more gifts faster than I do. So we might have to do that again. Look at all the cool stuff we have. Oh, I love this. See, I can put the fence up over here too. Whisper Jinx, you are so helpful. This is the coolest haunted den i swear and we've got all of these little gravestones we can put up now too oh we're gonna have fun with this it's gonna be so awesome we'll move this over a little bit we've got more creepy gravestones oh i didn't notice how there's like cool spiders going up and down uh the gravestone with the spider that's so neat oh yeah and i forgot about how we got this coffin too i don't even know where we're gonna put the coffin that's gonna be fun but yeah we'll have to rearrange our haunted mansion because it's getting a little bit out of hand but really cool and let's send explorer snow lily back to her home really quickly because she has one of the little houses up here in the sky kingdom that i really enjoy so we'll pop over here what do you think whisper jinx it's not a bad place we could probably make it a nice safe place for you too so we just got a little bit of food as a gift from the bunnies <laughs> so we can take that out and that is like one of the very first items that our wonderful explorer snow lily actually gets to enjoy and we do have the candy streamer um which really is like the only extra thing she's managed to get so how much would that wheelbarrow even sell for 150 150 gems candy streamer for 300 so yeah whisper jinx he came out on top why did we sell it because we're low on cash and well we're getting lower on cash and and because it makes it so that Explorer Snow Lily, thank you very much, can have earned a little bit of gems all on her own. She needs to start doing a little bit of furniture shopping. So what can we get with 300 gems? <laughs> hmm, which is the entirety of everything that she, she has owned so far. So let's check this. 
Uh, let's see. Anything over here? It would be helpful if we had... Oh, that would be kind of cute to be able to get our pirate ship couch. It'd be helpful if we had some idea, after all, of what Explorer Snow Lily probably wants in her house. Because we want to only give her the items that she manages to earn on her adventures or she manages to buy from her adventures. We don't want to just give her everything. Oh, that's so cool! Mop and bucket! Oh, that's adorable! Let's see, what else do we have? Oh, a beautiful daisy table. She could get a little stitch drug. That would be really cute. Better than nothing inside of her house, too. A twisted coat hanger, a frog rug. There's so many items. It just gives me so much inspiration for so many different things that I could do, too. She could have a recycle bin. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, look at the giant crystal. That is so cool. You know what? That does remind me, though, that it may definitely... Oh, she can have a beanbag chair. That's so cute. That is just so cute. All right. And it does remind me, though, that it may behoove us to go check out what's over in the diamond shop right now. So I think that's what we're going to do is we're actually going to jump over to the diamond shop and we'll see if there's anything there that Explorer Snow Lily really wants to try to earn. Oh, help. Oh, help. To a smaller place. Run away. Oh, there we go. All right. Hopefully, hopefully it'll keep to that world there. All right, and let's pop over and we'll look into, not the diamond shop, excuse me, but in here, in this cave with all the mystical stuff. All right, let's see. Painter's easel. These things are pretty expensive, but I think I could definitely see the epic wonder orb being something that she wants. Um, ah, we definitely need to get the opal birthstone and the diamond on display for the museum at some future point. Uh -huh, wow, the epic seasonal tree. That's so pretty. And we've got a lot of those too. And this, the giant trapped phantom, that would be so cool to have too. I love all of those items. Okay, well, back home. Oops, I meant back home. There we go. So Explorer Snow Lily, I'm sorry. You're not really doing that great with money yet, but that was just your first adventure and you got a wheelbarrow. I'm sure you can cook up some carrot stew even though you're a strict carnivore and she can hopefully enjoy that. Oh, and Whisper Jinx, I remember now. I knew I was forgetting something. I really, really wanted to see if we can get anything special for Whisper Jinx. So we need to go into his pet shop and the pet stop. So Whisper Jinx, what can we get for you, little buddy? Oh gosh, he's so cute. Well, we can get all sorts of special little hats, which are pretty adorable. Oh, look at his little hat. That's so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. Or you can get, oh, you can make him into a little stick -a Or you could give him a little Santa hat. Or you could give him like a little farmer hat. Those are all really adorable. And then over here, you can give them, uh, let's see, like a little tassel thingy. Or little maces, or little spikes, or a little beard, so he could have a whole Santa outfit. And then down here, he could actually have a little plant of his own following him around. Or he could have some little flowers, or he could have a little broom. That's adorable. I'm pretty sure last time I came, there were different options too. So do these options change every time you come? Or do they stay the same? I'm pretty sure they changed because I'm pretty sure some of those were different last time I came. We're going to have to get this for him. That's what we're spending our, our money on. Done. Whisper Jinx, you're just so cute with that little hat on. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Oh, I want it. I want it. Okay, we're going to do it. So that's what we spent her, her money on. But we can also go to the pet shop. And there's a mouse door. I'm trying to see if there's anything good for Whisper Jinx to be able to enjoy. A doggy door different food items. There's not really a house for Whisper Jinx, so if we happen to come across one, we'll have to make sure we give him one. But I don't think there's a good den thingy that we can give to him just yet. But I'm pretty happy with him, and oh my gosh, I've got so many adorable animals that people have sent our way. Oh, we're definitely going to enjoy hanging out with those guys. All right, so little Whisper Jinx has a cute little hat on for adventures too, and now maybe it'll be easier. She can be like, everyone thinks that you're a bad phantom and they're going to take you away. So she's stuck on a cute little hat to try to make him look more like a flower. So go explore Snow Lily, go. And then I guess now that we've done that one adventure, um, yeah, look at that. So we can start opening up the other adventures. And I know a lot of you guys were really eager for me to do adventures. Do they stay the same all of the time? Or, let's see. And then Epic Dens, Epic Haunted Manor. <laughs> oh my goodness, what's this one? 
It's, oh, so cool. We could we could adventure people's den, like around people's dens and the haunted manors. That would be really neat. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff we could potentially be snagging. Oh, there's even like fog down here. Very cool. So there's lots of adventures we can go on. But let me know uh, if you want me to, like, do the adventures stay the same all the time? Is it fun just to go and try to get different prizes for doing the same thing now and then? Let me know. Let me know and we'll go do that. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.